pitch we have here. The curved walls keeping the ball in play all the time should actually suit our attacking team rather nicely. We have been handpicked from the world's most famous clubs, but this is the first time any of these footballers have actually played together. Maybe Beckenbauer knew what he was doing by selecting all of these strikers. Look at the size of the Hurricane team. Goodness me, it's no wonder they're undefeated. Well, it looks as though the Galaxy 11 will kick off. Well, a bit of early intimidation on Messi here from Lennox, who I have to say is absolutely massive. We just hope they don't have the quickness to match their size. Just how are we going to defend against these beasts when we have no true defensive players? Certainly not a good time for a tactical gap. For a long time, arch rivals, now key teammates. Messi and Ronaldo ready to get us underway. And the stakes could not be higher. The battle for Earth's survival is well and truly on. And what a battle it's going to be. That was Lennox on Messi. That's an astonishing reach by Repsit with the interception. Yokte, fantastic effort off the curve ball. And he's running to the centre. Here's Lennox. An amazing effort back and over the front. Every pass gets here. The goalkeeper, no chance at all. One nil for the Hurricane. They do look bewildered, the Galaxy 11. Disorganised as well. Beckenbauer and the lads need to pull themselves together and quick. The fate of all humanity hangs in the balance. Eleven different styles and personalities, but they'll have to unite and try to play as one. The game restarted by the Galaxy 11 and Mario Goetze has certainly worked out the conditions here using the curve ball superbly. And it's a terrific turn from the German as well. He's looked to spring it to Ronaldo, who's taken that down. Great pass and he's taken down with no class by Chutka, who's going to get a yellow card from the alien referee. This is perfectly set up for Cristiano Ronaldo. How is team need him? It's a brilliant free kick and the save, I have to say, is even better. Ronaldo can't believe it. He's devastated. The throw from Agacha to the save is terrific too to hook kick. He's got kicks up and wide. Ripson is making his way into the middle. Looking for something special here. And he's come up with it. Oh, Casillas might have kicked that out, but he's hurt his shoulder. It's a second goal for the Horikan. And the Galaxy 11 have more problems. So 2-0 down. The Galaxy 11 really need to make something happen and soon. Here's the man who can make it happen. Lionel Messi, dancing fast defender in his characteristically brilliant style. He's still going Messi. He's drawn the goalkeeper and beaten him too. And he scored a marvellous goal. One from the Messi album. It's just brilliant in the nick of time. 2-1. And the Galaxy 11 are right back in this one. A terrific contribution from the captain. But Lennox is furious. They've never conceded a goal until now. Hurricane set the ball rolling again there. Pretty annoyed with the situation here, having conceded. To impose their will on the Galaxy 11 again. Lee Chung Young, that was a terrific challenge. The ball broke to Oscar, who's in a crossing position here. He's got Messi in the middle, he's got Ronaldo in the middle. Oh, they've got in each other's way and ruined the moment. It's a simple save for Akach. Good again. And show again this astonishing blend of technique, talent, pace, power. And the big mind is coming in there, can't stop them. This attack has got a real hint of menace about it. It's a great threat to Galaxy 11. It could be 3 1. It is 3 1. But for Galaxy 11 and the fate of planet Earth, it is very bad news. Well, there is the half time whistle. And for the Galaxy 11, it hasn't come soon enough. So it's with Beckham and Messi. Big task to get these guys playing like a team. Can football save the planet? 